Hey everyone, it's Dying Demon, and welcome back to Fortress Craft. Now, I've done a lot of work since we last played. I started working on, you know, evening things out, making it easier to get to stuff. My setup is still a nightmare, but I've started working on fixing conveyor belts, getting lithium. I've got lifts going up and down now. We're coming in today with uh, me having... What are they called? Um... Matter transporters. Now, I'll show you what they are if we get in there. I just unlocked them. But in basics, they are just tubes that transport matter from one little collector box thing. Uh, one... Oh, how can I not remember what they're called? Uh... Hopper. From one hopper to the next. And they can't be attacked by Minox, so that's good. My objective before I end up this episode is just to get lithium up and running right to fully charge the spider bot, which I have been working on. Also, I've been working on marbled ground and concrete reinforced walls. <laughs> Simply because uh, tunnel nukers are getting close. This guy is also starting to get charged. I've got him up to... 11, 100, uh, 117,000 energy out of 150. Where is he? Doesn't he come from this direction? Hmm. Uh, enemies have been getting rather close. I know that there's a tunnel nuker nearby that's... Uh, nope, you're a slime. Darn. There is a tunnel nuker digging its way to me. It's very, very close. I've been hearing more and more their little sounds, so they're pretty darn close. I've also started trying digging out holes through here to make it easier, but it's going to take forever to mine this out, and I don't have the energy set up to do it. Um, as you can see, this is a bit of a nightmare um, layout. <laughs> Sorry about that. I am currently at zero out of... I have a... Uh, or 16, and it's increasing 17, 18... Gonna keep going up. I have these right here, these threat reducers to keep my threat down because I'm nowhere near ready. And I'm using a laboratory to get a few extra research points. And this thing eats as much energy as you put into it, which is why I have it connected to my central power hub. I could technically just put a bunch of pyrothermics all around it and just feed cold into it, but the amount of threat that would create is beyond what I could handle. So, ah, oh, there's my spider bot. Now, I'm at 43 already. God, that's rising fast. Okay, let's start by going downstairs. I need to take all this out and replace it with, uh, speaking with lasers. Do I have enough lasers? I should. How many? Ah, no, didn't mean to do that. I don't have any power storage blocks, really. Uh, power storage. I don't have any lithium to make one either. Okay, I need to. There we go. That was a close one. I have got to put a railing for this thing, or really I need to go put in my lift. Um, when I get down here, did I bring my lift with me? I did. I'm going to put another lift down to get down ow, to my lithium. So what I've done is I've put down a... Uh, uh, where is it? One of these suckers, auto-excavators. Auto excavators, excavator like Escavez. Anywho, or Escavon, and it dug a hole all the way up there from way down. I'm talking into the cold level down. And these lifts are how I get up and down. It's pretty simple for anyone who's already played the game, but do, 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 do. Boop, I'm here. Alrighty. This is the cavern I found in a previous episode that has a lot of resources. I've just kind of lit the whole thing up because I could. So, the beam comes all the way down here. I'm going to need this to power my uh, teleporters. I'm trying, I don't know how far down this wall goes. But this is where I want to go down, so let's just start digging here. I'm going to put my... Uh, my, uh, why well, can I never forget remember what it's called? Um, 
uh, lift. That's what I'm putting here, my lift. Now, oddly enough, I love the excavators because they dig in the perfect size for lifts. You don't have to increase its size or anything, but unfortunately, I can't, I don't think I can set just how, oh, well, ow, there should be a lift here, which didn't go all the way to the top, why? There we go. So, if I build a lift, can I build my lift? Shoot, I don't think I pro I didn't do this right. So let's take my lift, set it. Alright, I'm gonna use some also found sand by the way. So I went pretty darn deep. I just dug a hole straight down, people. Never dig a hole straight down, even in this game. The rules of Minecraft still apply. So if I click on you and control click, you are right in front of me. So let me new line up even. So if I take you, dig a hole right here. Where's my lift? Uh, put my lift. Ah, no. Put my lift here. Huh? What? Well, that didn't work. First things first while I'm here. Take out some lithium. Take out more lithium. Charge you up. This is how I've been keeping uh, my knocks off of this thing, by the way. I've just been hand charging. So let's take a doorway. Then go up. I keep remembering to hit the right button. Alrighty. So, let's try this again. Hmm. Really? Really? <sighs> Gonna be one of them episodes. I can already tell. Click, 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 click. Ah, no. Place you on the underside. Oh, you're a bobble. But so what the heck are you? Oh, I also found some more, uh, uh, what are they called? Uh, fossils down here. So now I think I can build one more smelter, which is good. I want a dedicated lithium smelter. Lithium is your powerhouse. It is what creates a lot of your energy stuff. And I'm going to need it. Do, 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 do. Up I go. There we are. So take you. And then I can break you, break you. Just kind of break all of that. Then I can take this and place my piston. Which makes this. And break you and put my manual controller. Then just hold end to go up. Alright, so yeah, that was afraid of. I didn't properly line it up. Crap. Hold on, let me dig out all this. Unfortunately, if anything gets in the way, these things stop. And it's understandable, it's how physics work. How far up do I need to dig again? I mean, I'm up 21, so let's, let's keep going up. So if I do... Uh, you know, I've really got to memorize where my keyboards are, my buttons are. Here we go. Ta-da! We now have a way up from the very top to the bottom. I need another piston for that one shaft I about fell down, but meh. Here we are. Ow. So, my main issue comes right here. This thing only drops down to there. 
and I need it to come to this. And I'm also going to need this to power. All right, so this drops directly down on top of my. Uh... Hmm, I see a problem here. Can I take you and just make you come all the way up so I don't need this piston to go all the way up? I can then use, use it. Let me, let me work on that. I'll uh, cut back in a moment when I show just how incompetent I am. Okay, everyone, I'm coming back and I've done some basic changes already. So, now this takes me all the way down. Alright, so now... Let's see, this thing should shoot straight towards the middle. I'm going to use this as a relay right here. This, uh. So, where do you stop? You stop right here. Good. So, if I page you down, then stop you. How far down do you go? Right there? So. If I drop a bedrock right here, then I drop a laser right here. Good. And you seem to transfer straight down through this, which is good, but you won't be able to lift higher. So now let's go down some which takes forever while you're trying to get through. And I really should head up because I don't even know what my base threat is and I'm just kind of... Come on. Get below 60. Then you can speed up. Come on. The downfall of this machine. Extended 61 out of 60. Come on. Good lord. There we go. Now I honestly don't remember how high I had to be. Ah, no, go up, go up, go up. Up. Up, up. Don't want to go too far down. I can't stand the temperatures. I am at the very cusp of what my suit without a heater can handle. Alrighty, so. The thing is, I had to go down there eventually and. Mm, you. Go down more. So, I'm gonna have to place a block. I want it to go across here, so right there. Then place another laser. Huh. Put you down here. Place laser here. Rotate you out. Now. Here's the thing. Is there lithium? Here and I can just move this whole rig? If so, that's the best. Is there? Oh, please. But I can actually put it here with the power cube here. Yes! Okay. Break you, break you, break you. Thank you. So, let's put me an extractor right. Here, a power cube here. Let me provide some extra power to get it going. Alrighty. That's just how it's storing lithium. And 
if I understand this right, I can then put a transmitter right here. It'll beam resources to another hopper I can place right here. And then I put one on top of that that can also receive power from a laser and beam it straight up to the surface. Or at least so many meters up, I forgot how many. All right, so I now have an energy supply all the way down. I am making progress, let's head up. Um. Huh. Oh. There. Enough I go. If any of you remember my uh, previous video when I had that very crappy staircase, this is where it was. I just kind of did some work with it. Alright, you're doing just fine. See what I mean? I need to get another piston for here. Another time, another thing. Clip onto you. Ah. Ow. I really want to fist that. Ah, that ah no. <clears throat> Stop! <laughs> Nobody saw that. Repeat after me. Nobody saw that. Alright. Please, no copyright strikes. Alrighty, so. Base threat is seven. Ah, because I have things that aren't being smelted, right? Are you full? Oh yeah, because I took you offline. You know, I need to probably get some more material. I also need to get some more of this. Alright, before we begin, I want to explain something to you. So whenever I first started getting lithium, I was having a problem getting it. I was afraid I was going to need it for defensive purposes. So I was using this. So let me walk this through. By the way, I ran out of coal here, so I kind of had to move it. Coal extractor mines coal. It sends it down this way to down my defensive line. This way down my research production line, my little modules. But it also sends it here and up to this thing. I found out how the macerator works. You've got to have a conveyor belt that leads out and an external hopper that adds, I have wrong button, an external hopper that adds in, or that it has to add to. I get up to 300 materials in here and it doesn't give much. I mean, at a 300 material, I think I can get a, uh, oh, that's a pyrothermic. I think out of like the last 300, I got eight items, but a lot of that was from bedrock, so I got lithium, which is much needed. So speaking of which, hewn rock, let's drop in some bedrock. I should have started on this side. Let's drop in some bedrock. And for just the hell of it, I want to drop in some... I'm going to drop in some detrius. Detrius. Shit. Just shit. There you go. And over here, this makes construction paste. Now, construction paste is how I made these things. The marbled floor and the reinforced concrete walls. Basically, I just go to this one. I'll drop in a hundred here. I'll go to this one. I'll drop in a hundred here. I hope that I can get mass storage soon. I think that's what it's called. And let me do all of this. So, first things first. I need to get some lithium ongoing. I don't want to use you yet. I want to make my own storage hopper. I want two storage hoppers. And I need a new basic ore smelter. Yes, I have enough. Craft. So, how goes my research? Oh my god, you're not done yet. Here, Arthur. We're feeding this thing power. The poor, poor thing. Thing is, that's why my base threat hiked so high earlier. There was no power. I might get more rocks and get another smelter. One for copper as well. Keep copper and tin and all them separated. I'm getting distracted so easily. 
But the thing is, I think I've run out of organic fossils near me. So my only hope is to go towards where the tunnel nuker is laying down soft resin. I really don't like going there because of the giant worms that I am ill-equipped to kill. Well, Arthur just ran out of energy. You're almost done researching and everything can go back to power and... So, wow. Oh, der. Take this out and this. Now my base deck's really gonna rise. So, first things first. Knowing what I know about transporters, I want a hopper near here. So let's. I want to first start by placing a smelter. By the way, if you look at this and you just scream, why? Why are you doing this? Because I can. I'm going to drop you right. Do I want to drop? Yeah, I'll drop you here. I'm then going to put a storage hopper here and here. I'll figure out where it's going to arrive where I'm going to put everything. But for now, you're going to be remove only. You're going to be add only. And you could take... Wow, I have a lot of lithium. You could take my lithium. My base threat is just going to skyrocket. The reason why I'm not starting up tin and copper yet is I still, if I do that, it really will be more than I can handle, and without lithium, I am not ready to handle enemies. I need to upgrade to tier 2 uh, lasers. Come on. Poor Arthur, he's just pretty much a walking battery pack for me. He has so much energy, though. I mean, I can go underground for a very long time now. Oh, that explain ex that reminds me. I got every single Arthur upgrade and convert it to this. And I need I have a solar cell Mark One. I'm about to get some solar or a battery pack. I think it's called. Uh, nope, not you. You. Uh, yeah, suit power pack. I just need 24 lithium, which I can easily get. I have way too much iron. <laughs> From there, I need to... Hold on. Okay, no, I'm not hearing it. I have my music up in my headphones, and... Yeah. I need lithium, nickel, and titanium to make a better headlight. Nah. Alright. You're almost done. How's your energy recharge? Close enough. We're doing this. I literally put this energy cube here just so I could feed energy directly into it. I know I could do that from the power thing, but... Oh my, there's not enough power to even do that. Come on. Eh, oh well, while it does that, I'm gonna go show you what a, uh... No, no distractions. I'm about to go show you what a tunnel nuke is, but I keep getting distracted. First things first, I need to look at... Uh... Basic matter. I also want to know if anybody can tell me in the comments what a Falcor is and what the Falcor beacon does. It says it automatically collects loot, but from what? How do I decide that? Do I like put this down and it just zooms around and collects stuff out of my uh, hoppers and then puts those into my um the one without me needing a matter transporter? And then once it's in that hopper, then the matter transporter shoots it up? Because that's what it does. I want them. I need to really look into that. So I need tin and lithium. So I might have to turn back on you. Good God, why so much copper? No, I want tin. I have enough copper, just, just, no. No. If it ain't tin, you're not to put it in there. I so wish I could take ore and just disintegrate it and turn it into other materials. I don't think that's a thing. All right, let's see here. Hmm. Since I don't have the materials and things are doing what it's going to do for now, 
How about you? What are you at? Oh, you're on the final part. Just pump all your energy into it. Let us suck it all up. Actually, let me go to you. Not you. Boop. Let me go to... Yeah, shoot. Good. You. I'm just going to add power. That way this thing can keep sucking it up and I can finish pro uh, scientific research and we can call it done. Come on. Come on. Alright, it just used up all of its power. I just saw the lights dim on it. That's good. It means it should have finished its research. I should know soon enough when the when the uh, hub power starts recharging. Yep, it's done with research. Let me collect all that. And it's charging up. Recipes and projects. Nano disintegrator. A single juice machine capable of destroying anything that's placed on. Use with the Oh, so I could like use you to destroy like veins of metal that are in my way and I don't really care about. Cargo lift, rack, rack railer? Craft rack rails from iron bars. Using the automation of cargo lift rails. What? So you're a cargo lift. When a cargo lift controller, affectionately referred to as Lifty McLift Face. I get the reference. No, but let's research it. I want to research you, research you. Definitely researching you. Work floor excavator. Automatically digs a 33 meter wide, a three meter tall circle. Research. And then here's, ah, I should have researched you. Automatically collects much marked loot from Falcor beacons with 20, within 256 meters requires an attached storage hopper. Auto up. You know what? Let's just research everything that we can. Project. Now, you. Are you still not done charging? You are now. So... Is there a reason why power's not... Oh, I'm using as much power as it makes. Good lord. I need to find a way to increase the amount... I need a way to enrich my coal. Isn't there a way to do that? No, that's a project for next time. We've dilly-dallied long enough. Let's see. Threat is now 48. You are smelting me some lithium. That's good. How much did I need for this? Not you. You. I needed... Five. So there should be enough now. Yes, there's nine. And let me drop off some more lithium. Boop. Um, I needed ten, I think. And a lot of it. Is that entire conveyor belt empty? No, it's just crammed full. That's why nothing's moving. Alright, let's take out more copper. The more lithium, I mean, the more uh, uh, tin, the better. Uh, base threat is still rising. Without this, my base threat, I think, is like 200 plus. Okay, basic matter mover. Craft me one. So, up to 64 meters away. So, if I take some more lithium and make another one, I really want to make two more. I need 18 more tin. Okay, tin needs its own smelter. I'm sorry. So, I'm going to have to make a very dangerous decision. Speaking of which, I have no more of you. Do I need tin to make a uh, storage hopper? I absolutely do. You definitely need your own smelter. <sighs> Come on. There is just an overwhelming amount of copper. I'm trying to keep all the copper out. I mean, 
Good lord, I have enough copper and iron to last me a lifetime. Speaking of which, I shouldn't need to redo my coal for a while. Also, a little tip for those of you who want easy lithium with very little, with a bit time consuming. This. Coal. Rubble. Because you see, rubble gives you lithium, iron, copper, and uh, tin ore when it's done through a macerator. Speaking of which, whoop, whoop, you. See what I mean? I have all of that. I just heard a You probably can't hear it because I had the volume turned down for editing. But that sound usually means that a uh, tunnel nuker just went nuke. Alrighty, so do I have enough for some more? Boop, boop. Oh, my computer fan just kicked in. In case you didn't know, it's the middle of summer here in South Carolina, and it is currently 84 outside, and it is 91 in my bedroom because my computer is just constantly pumping out heat. Even with my air conditioner, I have bad airflow. I really need to get that fixed. Oh, well. Talk to the landlord one day. Or, let's see. So, oh, that's right. I forgot I popped some stuff in here. Take out some of that. Take out some of this. So, construction paste. It's Before we begin, I should let you know that construction items are the only kind that you can paint. Which I will show in a moment. Alright, marble. So, this is your basic marble. So fucking blowing, glowing white that it, it just blows out my recording. My computer does not like this amount of white. It's just too racist for it. I really shouldn't say that. Um, so, let's just say we put all this down. We then hit... What button did I hit? N? I've never looked. I just kind of found the back. And N. I already have it set to... If you right-click, you can change the color. Now, because I've exited, I've lost the color scheme I was using. Ooh. Ooh. N. Nope. Right-click. Uh... No, red was completely off. Was it something like that, I think? Except... Click. Nope, you're too bright. Right click. Red off. Except... You're too blue. Let's go back to this. Red off. You know what? You're close enough. I'll fix it later. Yeah, then you just... Click and go. And it doesn't cost any resources. It doesn't cost any energy. You just paint. Have fun. It's kind of relaxing. Do, do, do. Unfortunately, you can't paint wood, but you know. Also, you can grit most of your stuff right here by pressing C in Selfcraft. You can make canvas and the Dapper VIP, Dapper Frames. This is for people who have the Dapper DLC, by the way. Um, pumpkin Torch and... Halloween cauldrons and snowmen and chilled reinforced rock and neon border. I could never put that up. It's like it's going to hurt my head. And then dyed marble is what I'm using. But yeah, that's how construction paints work. Lithium ores offline. Yeah, I know. Um, let's go back to this. Uh, let me check. I need two to three of these. These regular hoppers. You know, I could use logistics hoppers, couldn't I? To pass the material up. But for now, I'm just going to do storage hoppers. Craft, craft. One more for good measure. And I want some more lasers. Something tells me I'm going to need lasers. So, craft one more of you. And one of you, just in case. So... Before I do anything, I'm going to go check out to see how close the tunnel nukers are getting. The closest one? Hmm. Alright, still not seeing any close by, that's good. But the closest was over here next to the uh, hive mind. Uh, I'm curious, can tunnel nukers destroy a hive mind? 
That's something I should really go to the forums and ask because I honestly don't know. There's our hive mine. You creepy little bastard. Okay. <laughs> there you are. You and your friggin' eye just staring me down. Thing is, what's creepier? He follows you. <laughs> Alrighty, what do we got over here? Now, where is that? T there it is. I don't think it made any more progress. I think it's because it's a straight shot from that tunnel. Could be wrong. Oh, hi there, lag. Oh, there are so many organic rocks there. Ah, well, hi there. You're what loaded in. <laughs> so it's good to know that when it's close enough, I can scan it. You are just one creepy bastard every time I see you. Let's not scan you. I want to keep it this way so every time I ping unknown, I know just how close my enemies are. If they're close enough that I can pick them up, I'm in trouble. Alrighty, so... There's enough of that. Let's go ahead and get working on lithium. Now, I, and the only reason why I'm not doing a lot of cutting this one, even though I'm already 40 minutes in, is simply because I want to show off as we do it. I'll probably cut out a bunch of smaller talk and things like that. So if like I'm in the middle of a conversation and boop, gone, that's why. Alrighty, let's get working. Why? Oh, that's right. I walked too far away, so you have to uh, reopen. All right, lithium, another 19 bars. Let's drop off some lithium right here. You'll take four so I can deposit more in. There you go. How about you? What's my base threat is zero? Good. I know people are like, oh, that's bad. You shouldn't be taking it down. I'm doing that because I am not ready. I cannot handle the amount of base threat I currently have. So we're going to start by just charging you. And the way this works, it takes the uh, lithium out, runs it through a coiler, or I mean through a extruder. The extruder turns it into a coil, which sends it into this charging station. If I can get up there. This charges it using power from the uh, PTG, the pyrothermic generator, which is getting its coal from right here, or no it's not, from over there. Now, this one needs a constant 33 or so power per second to charge it. And as you can see, it's doing its best to charge it. There you go. It charged it and sent it over here, and it received a thousand more power. And it keeps doing this until it's charged it all. Yep. See how it reaches a thousand power right here and it immediately just spits that over there? One, zero, done. Now, the main issue is I have a coal deposit right here, and I didn't move it. I'm going to do that later. I'm going to take all this and move it so I can get a fresh coal supply without having to keep dragging it over. But then again, that's not that big of a deal. I have that much coal in my inventory. All right, let's head down and get to work. Ah, that was stupid. I'm falling. Why the heck did I uh, just shoot downwards? Durr. I am tr the reason why it's taking me so long is I'm trying my best to avoid Minox. I have seen the devastation they can cause to a base. Also, how much iron is left? Five million, I'm good. Let's head down. Here we are. <laughs> that is a lot. I need to figure out how much lithium I have. Down we go.
There we go. Empty out storage, empty out storage. Now, lithium, how much is there? Half a million, or well, 852,000. It's not a lot, actually. Uh, ping known. Lithium is that bluer, because there's more lithium over here if need be. And here. Anywhere else? Need to go easy on that. It'll eat up my. Uh... This is saying there's another crystal nearby here. Could just be the one glowing. Okay, by the way, these crystals glow way too dang bright. Then I'll throw down torches. They have a much softer glow. Doot, 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 doot. There we go. Two emerald crystal. Ah, oh, I was standing right on top of you. Whoop. There's some more emeralds and diamonds lying around, but I'll get to them later. Hmm. Alrighty, so now that I know. I am always afraid I'm going to run a camera bot down here. Okay, so. If I take. You. So it's in a straight line that it has to go, right? So if I take you and place you. Here, oh my lord, you eat up a lot of energy. Do you also need energy? You have no power. Do I only need one hopper? Like this one hits here and then goes straight up? Let's power all this up. I, am, I luckily have a giant amount of power. There we go. You are now full power. So let me take a power cube. Place you here. And start powering you up. Oh, that won't work. I'm a derp. Okay, so, come on. Take you out. Take you out. Hmm. That seems to be a problem. Okie dokie. Uh, stupid stubby legs. For now... So instead, let's put it like this. Power cube here. Fully charged. Oh no. Did you go all the way down? Take me down. Lithium ore. And one of these. Okay, go back up before you use up all your battery. There you go. Now let's get back up here. Now, I'm going to take you and place you here. And then you are now draining all the battery from here, but you're fully charged. And you are receiving energy from the cube. It's going to take a while for your fuel to be fully powered. 
thank goodness I'm receiving enough power in a given moment to uh, power both of them. I need to give you a lens. This seems to be working. So. It's going to be a bit of a slow trudge. But it's better than nothing. So take me back up. <laughs> Slime dad. So if I just charge. Oh shoot. I'm out of energy. Oh shoot. Oh shoot. Didn't think that through. Didn't think that through. What? 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 Hypothermia. Up, 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 up. Whoa, game. That wasn't good. What the hell just spawned in? Oh, please don't tell me I'm under base attack. Uh, get me up there. Uh. Come on. There we go. Whew. I did not think that one through. <laughs> Alrighty. Alrighty, here we go, we're up top. Base threat, zero. Everything's charged, everything's working, give me that. You can fudge right off. Oh, my back. How goes my spider bot? Oh, he's almost done. I want him charged and patrolling. I want to watch the moment he comes off his stand. Take some more lithium. That should be enough. Yes, I know we need titanium. Speaking of which, how are you doing? Thank you. So, that matter blaster thing. Uh, what lens do you have? You have emerald? Um, let me make a few more lenses. I also want to make a, uh, uh, I want to make another, um, transmitter and another power cube to keep it powered. Okay, but of course it's all getting all that done. That's the problem. We need three more. Come on. One more. Or two more, sorry. Let me know. Oh, yeah, you. So much copper. Come on. Hi. Alrighty, that should be it. You should be after. Like, there's a coil waiting, if I'm not mistaken. It's just waiting on this to get done charging. Come on. It'll be done in five seconds, so I want to go ahead and take all of this. I can use the rest of it to make another transmitter. And another cube. And with that, I think you're fully charged. You will be soon, in one second. You are now fully charged. The bay is ready to... What are you doing? Okay, you're on patrol now. So now that he's received full energy, he will patrol the uh, area. He will walk around. Anything that is too dangerous, like let's say tunnel nukers, gets in the range, he shoots it. If we're ever under attack, he starts walking towards it to kill it as well. Of course, he has a very weird walking pattern, and he likes to climb up mountains. Dude was made to be a hermit on a mountain. Okie dokie. So, now we got that going. First up, I want some power storage blocks. No. I want one of you and one of you. Make two of you just in case. 
And I want one more. How much do I need to make one more basic matter remover? I need a 16, or 12, sorry, here, I'm going to count. 12 of you, so six more. I only want you to take in 10 right now. I know you got a crap load of copper, but just bring me 10. Uh, 10, there we go. I wonder why it's doing that. It's probably because of the way I have it set up. I'd be better off putting... You just scared the piss out of me. I'd be better off probably redoing this. You see how there's... It does like this? Keeps it well balanced, but it's just... Ten is what I need more. I have thousands, literal thousands of copper. Speaking of which, how much copper do I have left? Uh, M. 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 Thank you. Oof. 500,000 copper left. Alright, nothing new here. It's a ping known. Copper is green. I have a small one over here. I have a damn large one right here. But over this way. Oh, what was that? Hmm. Okay. So, let's get back on track. I'm probably going to cut that part out if I if you hear me saying it, I didn't, but I probably should have. Alrighty. Damn, you're right. Let's get working on the next portion. Ow. When you walk down too fast and hurt yourself. Ow! Here's my question. What happens if I... So you have a connection and you're ready. For you, you are sitting against the far wall. If I'm not mistaken, you go up exactly along this. So, and looking down, it would be left to the laser. It would help if I had a map and I knew which damn direction I'm looking. Because this one goes right down the center. Matter mover is fully charged. You know what? Oh, not what I meant to do. Ow. We're gonna try something stupid here. Let's see here. So, let's keep going up. I think this is a... Whew. So if I place it here... I honestly don't know how far away this is from it. I should have counted, but... Let's find out. Actually... Place you here. Hmm. 
Have you detected one? Or does it only transport hopper to hopper? Huh. I was hoping I could daisy chain these suckers. Gotta stop doing that. I'm gonna kill myself. So transmission comes that way. So point you straight up. Didn't I? Yep. It fires up. Did it drain my hopper? So I can daisy chain them. That's good to know. For those of you who are still bearing with me through this nightmare, this is all trial and There is so much copper down here. So you're going to go all the way up? Fudge. Come on. Hey. You. Come on down. Thank you. Did you just... Well then. Um, I found my new home. Jesus. All right, let's get back up. We now have a... Yeah, this is going to take a while if you haven't noticed. This is all new to me. So you should be stopping here. It allows me to go right here. You. We'll shoot straight up. Good. So... Let's head this way. I stop hitting the wrong button. Speaking of which, I got a a lens for you. Any uh, long-time players, people who have always played this game, see this and have any comments? I'm sorry. wonder. can't believe I'm about to try this. But... Um... Hopper. Yeah, I know. You know, the power cube, don't I? Ow!
Faster than an elevator. Okay, people, I'm coming back. I kind of cut off on you midway there because I've been trying. I've been focusing and trying to get this done. So let's get this done. First up, I'm gonna need some more conveyor belts. I've decided instead of trying to beam it all the way up for now, I'm gonna settle for you know part of the way, and then it hits a uh, a hopper and then just sends it on up. So I'm going to need to get another laser down there too to, this is, there we go. And that's how you break a fall. Ah, no, whoops. Click this way. Let's make sure it's still traveling up, it is. Almost there. That close. Are you kidding me? Pull me on up. Oh no. No 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 no. Uh. About seeing your life flash before your eyes. I swear OSHA would have a field day with me. Alright, let's click on you. And we're going to make a few more of these. I don't think it's enough. It is definitely not enough. Um, how about you? Make me more ten. I need ten. Just make ten. Forget everything else and just give me ten. Get rid of you. Drop in some ten. Get rid of you. Drop in some ten. Just keep getting rid of you and keep dropping in ten. The more tin you give me, the better. Well, let's craft a few more. Eleven more. This should put me at the cusp. And let's see. Yours is right here. If I do this, click. I shouldn't have to put myself in danger to bring up my titanium. Or my lithium. Oh, I'm going to turn you this way. And I'm out again. Really? <laughs> Forgot just how much resources I need. There we go. So take you and push you here. Nope. Gonna lose that one. I'll come back for it in a moment. Got the ore back. Ah, oh, shoot! I can't do that because I'm gonna block my uh, laser. Alright, um, I'm gonna do something stupid for a moment. I'll fix it. Click. Click. and click so from there I just have to this is a nightmare all I wish I had just transported click you do do do. click you do do do. click you do do do. and then really really get me out of the hole I am not Edgar there we go. So now, should be able to take. Oh. Let me up. Should be able to take you. Once I learn how to jump. Guess not. So we're going to take this, 
click it like this. There you go. We now have a lithium conveyor belt. Now the only thing we're missing is power. If I'm not mistaken, a laser is all I need to fix that. And I honestly don't remember. Oh, that was a audible thud. Enough grunting. Oof. Okay, so. Oh, shoot, that was close. So the laser's transporting up here, but there's not enough energy to charge it. That means I need a laser right here, so along this outer edge. So if I come up along the conveyor belt, on this corner, right here. Oh, well, that's going to be a bit of a problem. Ah, let me out. Whew. So, it's, if I'm not mistaken, right here. I dig this straight down, I should be able to see it, and I can just use a laser. It's not going to be the fastest thing using lasers to shoot downwards to this thing, but it's better than nothing. Jesus. How much further down do I have to... There we are. In this corner. Right here, right? Is it this corner? Oi. Yeah. It's this corner. Right here. Good lord, what just happened to me? Uh, hello? <laughs> well, it was gonna happen eventually. <laughs> you don't hop around that much with a, with a grappling hook for nothing. Okay. Next up, laser. That shoots down right here. Do I have... I do not. Shoot. Okay, time for some building. Come back when I get lasers going, too.
Okay, everyone, I'm coming back. Now, before we begin, just ignore this nightmare right here. I've literally just have energy just sitting around in cubes to make it easier to transfer. I hope that I'll eventually sit down and just fix my entire power system, but for now, <laughs> this is it. So, I needed one more laser to bridge the gap. So, let's see here. Alright everybody, I'm coming back. Uh, sorry for how long I've probably been gone. Um, let's see, I've been recording for an hour and 27 minutes and I went away at, uh, 40. Alrighty, so, I managed to get laser set, uh, laser setup going. Energy's being beamed down, everything's going good. You know, I really should look at, to see if there's any better lasers. But, to do what I created, uh, this monstrosity. It's just my god. Um, but I run into a problem. You see, along the way, see here, at one point the conveyor is blocked. Right there. So I'm going to take this. Click on you. There we go. We now have titanium being run. Hell yes. Now it's going to be a bit slow. There's only so much right now because it was backed up. But the amount of energy it takes to run this is obscene. You see what I mean? And until I get some better energy production and better lasers to uh, properly send the power. Ah, take me up thank you so I get better lasers to send the power are you kidding me no two cell put safety uh bars you know what fuck it kill me Jesus Christ all right let's try this again so I'm going to see if I can get better lasers, but for now, we actually have lithium production. Like, full-fledged, automatic lithium. It's slow as all hell, but it's better than nothing. That's all I can say. I mean, don't you... No! No! I forgot to take my finger off F. Yes! Catapult. Get me no! <laughs> okay, me and holes do not mix. I have said this in one of my very first episodes. That there's a hole. I'm going down it. Okay, is it safe? Am I alive? <clears throat> All right. <laughs> Laser energy transmitter Mark One. I can actually make you. Uh, you do. Uh, from a generator or battery up to 64 meters can power a machine, battery, another transmitter attached to a wall to send power vertically. Uh, what's its transmission rate? Very low, and this one's, I'm guessing, decent? I should check that out, really. But yeah, now that we have lithium production ongoing, we have... Uh, I just gotta upgrade some power systems. I don't know why I have ore coming. Oh, you will be add only. You will be remove only. There we go. Now that I have lithium, I can actually start getting things done. Like, if I have enough right now, can I? I can. I now have a suit power pack. Hell yes. There we go. But now my next goal is this. I need charged PCBs to make a turret. So, which one of you is my PCB maker? You? You know what? I'm gonna click on you. I don't have a lot of lithium, but make me some stuff. Pick up that plates. Get rid of you. 
Uh, click on you. I have two, so craft a four. It takes, and I just need four charged PCBs. Sweet. In fact, I now have enough. I mean, I know I'm making plates in the meantime, but Oof. click on you. I need two more. And you know what? As soon as I get done making these, I'm calling it quits for the day. It's going to take me a while to edit all this down and upload it for you, but hey, it's a start. Thank you, by the way, for those of you who actually stayed through the entirety of that nightmare. That is me trying to figure out how that works. My God, that looks epic. Come on, print me a board. Thank you. I'll take one of you. And I'll take one of you. Tin ore extractor offline again, so I'll take y'all. Send me about the spider bot. He just likes to climb up. Every Let me get rid of all this. Seems like a nightmare to have him climbing over all that. During the invasion, it can also block his line of sight and he'll just waltz up a mountain and just screw a lot of stuff up. There we go. Now I have way too many tree trunks. You know, I'm gonna keep. But yeah, let, let's just finish this up. I'm gonna keep going on and on and on if I don't go now. Climb back up. Climb back up. You seem to be having a hard time with that hill. You can climb a mountain, but you can't tackle a hill. That's just pathetic. All right. Boom. Ooh. All righty. Let's get over here. We'll click on you. Make me four turret mark twos. I'll use and replace these and everything in the next episode. But for now, this is Dying Demon. And thank you for staying with me through the nightmare that is me trying to uh, get lithium to the surface without having to worry about my Nox. And this monstrosity. But until next time, I'll see you later. Bye.